हेलो चिल्ड्रन टुडे आई एम हियर विद क्लास फाइव सेकंड लैंग्वेज इंग्लिश पार्ट टू मॉडल क्वेश्चन पेपर विद आंसर्स लेट अस स्टार्ट वी हैव सॉल्व्ड ऑल दिस शीट्स नाउ विल गो फॉर पार्ट टू इन दैट देयर द क्वेश्चन ट्वेंटी वन फ्रेम अ सेंटेंस यूजिंग द गिवन पेयर ऑफ राइमिंग वर्ड्स गिवन ओके वॉट यू हैव टू डू इज देर द राइमिंग वर्ड्स pair is given by using those pairs you should frame a sentence okay for each pair right uh, let us start for example uh, my mom served one hot soup from the pot or my mom served me hot soup from the pot you can write like this here okay next b stop and shop is given for that you can write like this i want to stop at the shop to buy a box on my way to school i want to stop at the shop to buy a box you can write any other sentence on your own okay next to question number 22 write any four words starting with the given letters there they have given uh, letters S W right, so from the letter S W you have to write four more words. From S W we can write sweet, we can even write sweat, swim, and then sway or soup. You can write anything. Now let us go for your question number twenty three. In this, there they have given. Read the rhyme and answer the given questions. What you have to do here is to do this. Before that, you should read the rhyme given there. Okay. Mummy dear, daddy dear, I love you. I love you. See your baby dancing just for you. Just for you. Mummy dear, bab, daddy dear, I love you, I love you. See your baby singing, just for you, just for you. What you have to do here is, read the rhyme, understand it. What is given in the rhyme, you should understand clearly, and then read question twice, and then answer for it. What are the actions done by the child? You can see in this. Uh, rhyme two actions done by the baby right one is dance one is sing okay see here so you can write answer like this the actions done by the child are dancing and singing here you can write in the space provided the actions done by the child are dancing and singing let us go for your next page see like this way you can write your answer okay uh, we will go for next page yeah to do this question you have to read the given story and then you should answer question number 24 and 25 okay i'll re i'll read it for you just listen to me as i read Anil lived in a village. <coughs> Anil lived in a village. He had a farm. He had six cows, ten sheep, two cats, and two dogs in his farm. He had a jeep and a tractor too. Where did Anil live? In the passage itself, in the story itself, you can find right. Anil lived in a village. So same answer you can write here. Anil lived in a village how many animals did he have in his farm you should total all these animals six cows 10 sheep two cats and two dogs so in total they are 20 in number okay answer should be like this there uh, sorry he had uh, 20 animals in his farm you can write like this he had 20 animals in his farm this you can write in the next line 
ओके आई विल शो यू इन द नेक्स्ट पिक्चर नेम द व्हीकल्स विच अनिल हैड इन हिज फार्म सो इट इज गिवन हियर इन द लास्ट लाइन ही हैड अ जीप एंड अ ट्रैक्टर टू राइट सो यू कैन राइट लाइक दिस यम अनिल हैड अ जीप एंड अ ट्रैक्टर इन हिज फार्म ओके विल गो फॉर नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी सिक्स वॉट दे हैव गिवन हियर इज ड्रॉ द पिक्चर ऑफ अ बर्ड कलर इट एंड राइट टू टू थ्री सेंटेंसेस अबाउट इट ओके यू कैन ड्रॉ एनी बर्ड पिक्चर ओके एनी बर्ड पिक्चर एंड देन इन दिस स्पेस प्रोवाइडेड यू शुड ड्रॉ अ पिक्चर ओके गॉट इट आई शो इट फॉर यू इन द नेक्स्ट पिक्चर लाइक दिस वे यू कैन ड्रॉ एनी बर्ड योर एंड देन यू कैन राइट अबाउट इट सी लाइक दिस वे यू हैव टू ड्रॉ as i have shown in this picture you should do okay it is not clear but uh, you can get the idea from here okay let us go for next uh, page what is given and then you should write in this space provided all about the word i have drawn a uh, peacock in the space provided so i will write about the peacock in the space provided i'll write like this peacock is india's national bird it is a beautiful bird it has beautiful long feathers with golden eyes on it its fe its feed on worms tender shoots of the plants etc it dances during the rainy season i love to watch its dancing okay like this way you have to write about the bird which you have drawn there in the box okay you can write it easily do not panic we'll go for question number 27 now in this question they tell you to write a message to your doll wishing on his or her birthday what you have to do here is you should write a message to your doll okay and also you should wish her on her birthday and also you should plan how you will celebrate her birthday okay that you have to write in 3 to 4 sentences um i'll give you one sample here you can write like this way happy birthday my sweet doll i'm so excited to celebrate your special day with you we will have a fun day of playing games eating cake and opening gifts i can't wait to make this day extra special for you i adore you the most okay like this way you can write to your favorite doll a happy birthday wish as well as how you'll celebrate her birthday okay uh, yeah this is a sample if you want you can take a screenshot and write down or else you can uh, lower the speed and listen to this audio okay i mean video okay uh, let us go for your question number 28 look at the given picture and write three to four lines about it you can see an elephant in the picture and the children are behind it and uh, a person is riding an elephant everything you can find right that you have to write here i will write like this way say in this picture i could see a sage has bought an elephant to a town where children are happy to see the arrival of an huge animal they are running behind the animal and trying to talk to it some are dancing with happiness and some are just playing with their friends they welcome the happy elephant with their dance and happy faces you can write like this way okay um if they give something else you have to describe on your own do not leave the space blank just fill it okay all the very best for your exams and thank you thank you so much If you liked my video do not forget to subscribe and do forward it to the needy ones thank you once again